Uh, Blabs, <laughs> give her, give everybody a rundown of what Rule Thirty Four is. Blabs. Concord is a game that we've talked about for months now. Ever since its first initial release trailer, we had the ambiguous characters, the overweight uh, action heroes, the pronouns and the and the bios of all these characters. And pretty much as soon as it was the first trailer was launched, people were like, yo, <laughs> this ain't good, dog. Um, and it is released. And I'll tell you this, it has not gone well uh, to the tune of um, just ac across the board when you look at uh, these games and the success, specifically with Concord, we've seen the failure of Dustborn, now Concord, and Concord currently, a multiplayer game on Steam has 210 players on it the, the Monday after the weekend of its launch. It's saving lives. <laughs> it's, it's saving lives? How so, Blabs? I'm being sarcastic. I'm comparing it yeah, to the MCU of uh, that movie that flopped out. Eternals. Eternals. It's saving yeah. lives. The diversity was going to save people's lives. That yeah. something an actor actually said. Well, mm -hmm. I'll tell you this. Yeah. It, is, it is saving people money, which is good. <laughs> They, they don't that have is to go saving out lives. They can go out and eat food. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Concord. That's right. Good for them. Well, the response to this has been, uh, it's been rejected to half court by pretty much everybody in video games across the board. And it doesn't, uh, you know, a lot of this stems from uh, the response. This, I think these games in particular between Concord, uh, Concord, Dustborn, and Black with Wukong, this is such a great example of the clear divide behind the consumers and the developers of these games. Uh, when you look at the success that you see with Black Myth Wukong versus Concord and Dustborn, uh, it's nuts. But it doesn't help that you have people within IGN who is a, uh, this is a community lead over at IGN, who say, well, we'll just, we'll just read this X thread from them. It says, <laughs> uh, man, Concord really is scratching that multiplayer itch I, I've uh, had for a while. Everything is designed immaculately. And each character choice feels deliberate for a character's uh, kits to, to map layouts. If you're looking for a new shooter that values you squatting up or running solos, this is it. And this guy says, it's not too late to delete this. Not too late to become a decent human being. So, <laughs> so uh, going to bat for, uh, for the game itself. By the way, it is really important to point out that uh, Jad Jadirina, Jadirina is this person's name. Jedediah. And, uh, Jedediah. She, her, they. Jedediah. Right. <laughs> I love it. That's right. Uh, I don't pretty... get that. I've never understood that. how you she, her, and they. That's right. That's I, right. Which one are you? I mean, and they, the they oh, thing never makes dude. any sense. But yeah, I love that she has all. Oh, you know the... what I've seen? What's up, Labs? Go on, Flash. I was oh, no, said, I was also say, love I've that seen, she's got the BLM and the trans lives thing in there and well on a delay i think anyway yeah i've seen that he pronouns are she he they and i'm like how does that happen how can you well, be all of them i'm all of them and you're, you're I, never wrong i'm all, I'm all <laughs> the jedi you can never be wrong <laughs> i'm That's all the, the trans <laughs> well it, it continues here because this game has flopped dramatically to the oh, point beautiful. to where i don't uh, craig i don't think i've ever seen something flop like this no, no, uh, this is really don't. I mean, like this well, is Suicide a Suicide Squad at least had a couple thousand people playing it. Yes, it at least correct. had did it peak at 13,000 still bad. But I mean, at least it had <laughs> at least it had thousands. Well, people what's amazing playing about it. this? What's amazing about this is the response from journalists and they just don't understand it. Once again, keep in mind the divide, the divide. You have these journalists in a bubble. And the and consumers, right? So we've talked about Paul Tassi on our show before. Uh, he's from uh, we we have a couple journalists from Forbes and Verge who just they don't understand the failure associated with this. This is from Paul Tassi. He says, um, "Okay, I just got out of a movie, and like, there's no way this is right, right? I'm not trying to be mean. I genuinely, it genuinely doesn't make sense to be this low. I've never seen anything like this." He's talking about the number of players in the game with the all-time peak being less than 700. And uh, he says, almost really uh, really wondering what the peak is today. It could be less than the open beta at 2,300. Um, 
And this continues. And this guy from The Verge is like, is this accurate? Like, there's no way this is right. Is the Steam DB data for Concord broken? Surely there's more than 500 people playing it on Steam right now. And the answer is no. <laughs> and Paul continues, says, I knew this wouldn't, wouldn't go well, but this is legitimately weird. Suicide Squad launched with 20 times as many players. I'm, wonder I'm wondering if there's something going on. Yeah, the timing is weird too. Like it peaked early afternoon and didn't even add a couple hundred players after work and school in America. I don't get it. Well, that's just it, Paul. You don't get it. Listen to the consumer. I don't know if there's a better way to describe how out of touch you are with the consumer itself. This is the audience, and it's they not, clearly don't want anything to do with the game. It's not just the journalists. It's also the people in the Western gaming industry. None of them get it either, and they're going to continue to lose money left and right. Like We've got the Asian developers now starting to come back because... I mean, for what, what would you say the past 10 or so years? I mean, it's kind of been Western developers on the top yeah. and now it's flipping back because it used to be the Eastern developers before. And now it's going back because they're giving people what they want, especially South Korea. They've really been putting some bangers out. Now you've got China coming in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's a demand. The gaming demand is still there and people are going to oh, get 100%. what they want. They'll go, they'll go elsewhere. Yes. Now. It goes a step further as even the developers are chiming in on this. This was uh, captured the other day. And, and they the developers, they don't want to hear any of your criticism, you bigots. All right. They don't want to hear it from you because they made a great game that that if you don't like it, you're part of the problem. Right. You're a freak. You freak. Countless freak. That's right. This is uh this is a, a developer says it's Concord's release day. So insanely proud of our team and what they and we have accomplished. A labor of love like nothing else. Been playing it so much since early access started a few days ago, and I'm so excited to be available to everyone. I'm so honored to have this. This be my first AAA game. It was a huge learning experience. Lots of struggles, but I'm glad to have gone through them. Time to go play responses says i'm sorry this has to be or this is from just a random person on twitter it says i'm sorry this has to be your first i do not believe it is you or any of the other devs faults that this game has performed so badly i can tell that a lot of effort was put into it into completing this game uh it just comes at the wrong time and genre they respond with says and eh, i don't really care it was a huge labor from a lot of insanely talented people making an awesome game why would I care about, about a bunch of talentless freaks hating on it? I'm, I'm sure having fun playing it, but I wouldn't trade it for nothing. Talentless freaks, they respond. <laughs> I, actually, I actually came to drop some positive criticism, but get fucked. Clearly, uh, clearly based on the games, you're the one who has no talent. So <laughs> there it is right there. Um, so they're not taking it very well, to say the least. Um, so that's kind of where it's at. Um, I understand being upset about your game not performing well, right? But you don't need to lash out publicly at the people who are trying to come in and, and give you honest criticism along the way. And that's that's what we're seeing right here. Um, they went out of their way to make sure there would be no Rule 34 with this game. Ah, yes. And uh, that's, that's, that's hurting them because well, that's not happening with the Eastern games. At least some of the Japanese games, yes, but they're not all, they're not all, bending the knee down well you may be asking yourself uh about about that rule 34 because when you look at this the character selection i mean not many people are asking about the character the rule, rule 34 but since we're talking about it uh the number of characters when you look at concord along the way you know you got these guys here this one most notoriously um <laughs> you got you got an amalgamation of just she thems and they they theirs and Z i them love that and, that character is so fat it's she's so fat she has to pull the jeans over her belly over her fupa yeah. <laughs> like santa claus that's right um but yes even concord has broken rule 34 as you can't find it anymore now blabs you're familiar with rule 34 most unfortunately yes okay so uh blabs <laughs> give her give everybody a rundown of what rule 34 is blabs for those who i'd rather know. not to be honest well no it's, it's important. I, I, you I don't want to do it. Craig, you can do it. Go oh, ahead. Do you want her to search it? I was just no, going to say, it's just, it's basically that there's porn for everything. On the internet, you can find porn of everything. Somebody right. has made it. 
except for Concord. <laughs> <laughs> nobody wants to fuck those characters. <laughs> no, no, nobody does it all. Nobody does it all. Um, so I went in and I was looking at the player counts for Concord and Dustborn and Blackmouth Wukong. And I, I really just wanted a visual representation of what that looked like. So I went in to Canva and I got a generic set up for, for uh, you know, just to describe the different different player counts between the two, uh, between the three games. And uh, this, is, uh, this is an accurate representation of the player counts uh, between here. You have... Black Myth Wukong with nearly 2 million players and Concord and Dustborn. By the way, Dustborn is actually lower than Concord uh, right now with 30 players live at the time of this. <laughs> and I just said, I can't think of a better visualization for what the gaming audience is asking for than this chart based on the current player base of Black Myth Wukong, Concord and Dustborn. It's literally staring the in industry in its face. Why won't they listen? I mean, it's right there. It's right there, Flash, and I don't understand it. 